Damn, I have no socks. Damn, where are my socks? I'm always fucking late, cause I smoke a lot. If we had a date, yeah, I'm sorry, I forgot. 20 minutes late, pulling up to my job. Yeah, I smoke a joint, just a roll of fucking blunt. Yeah, I'm rocking camo pants, but I ain't trying to hunt. I, I haven't done my laundry in about a month. It, it's okay, I buy a whole new outfit just to stunt. Wait, wait, you hate on me, but at my show, you're in the front. Hold up, you're fake. Hold up, you're done. stream i feel like i might need to turn this music up this is a little bit quiet we'll make it a little bit louder hello chat how are you doing today um it's a very this is a kind of late stream for me i don't normally stream this late i really need to change the thing on my twitter that says that i stream from 4 to 6 p.m est because it's not true at all <laughs> i stream like 7 p.m. most of the time or later or if I have stuff going on in the later day later in the day I'll stream at like four I don't know I'm already seeing some interesting ones as soon as I I searched I searched funny quizzes and BuzzFeed came up and I was like oh yeah <laughs> and I'm already seeing some interesting ones <laughs> Find out which Encanto song is your 2022 anthem. Holy shit. Pick your favorite Encanto character. Um, Luisa. How many siblings do you have? One. Pick a Disney song. Oh. Ooh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking Bear Necessities are friend. I'll do friend like me. Like a school subject. Um, art. That's like the least difficult one. Pick an X Men character, Rogue. Pick a music genre. Um, rock. Pick a word that describes you eager, stressed, secretive, curious, energetic, sad. <laughs> Sad. Just nothing. Nothing else. <laughs> Sad. Pick a Disney princess. Mulan. I love Mulan. 
how many times have you watched Encanto? Um, t actually, no, three, because I watched it in class once. Can I not go back? Can I not go back? Oh, it's waiting on a miracle, of course. I think they just saw the word sad, and they were like, yeah. Let me, let me quickly fix this. I wouldn't say sad, actually. Probably, probably energetic in real life. I don't know. Hold on. How many times do you want? Three. <laughs> Waiting on a miracle. Which one do you think it goes off of? Like, the most. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> it's obvious what type of men you attract based on your messy food preferences. Holy shit, I want to find out which which food I prefer. Chicken wings? I'm vegetarian. Barbecue ribs? I'm vegetarian. Powdered donuts? I like powdered donuts. They're a little messy. They taste good though. I like them. I like there. Crab legs? I'm vegetarian. Deep dish pizza? Um no. Right there. I'm vegetarian. Spaghetti and meatballs. Okay, but if it's like veget I've had spaghetti and like vegetarian meatballs and it's good, but I guess it means like actual. I'll do like tacos. I have like some vegetarian tacos. I don't know. Most of them are meat. I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Cheese puffs. Um. Oh, cause they got the sticky stuff all over your hands. <laughs> but they're good. They're good. I just don't. Okay. Yeah. S'mores. Yeah. Croissant. I don't really like <laughs> pastries. Nachos. They're they're okay. I don't, I don't I don't mind nachos. Watermelon. Yeah, I like watermelon. Corn on the cob. Yeah. It's good depending on how it's cooked. <laughs> I'll leave that neutral. Cheese fondue. Yes! Chocolate fondue. Um. Sure. I don't know. Fried onion. Yeah. Ice cream sandwiches. Right there. No. <laughs> what type of men do I attract? <laughs> the artistic type. It's because I'm a vegetarian, isn't it? <laughs> they, went, they went, you're a filthy vegan. <laughs> I, wait, I saw this one. Tattoo artists are sharing the overdone designs people should stop getting and points were made. That's Justin Bieber. That's not a tattoo artist. What do you mean tattoo artists are sharing the overdone designs? <laughs> and that have Justin Bieber. Or is it saying that Justin Bieber's tattoo is overdone? Because it kind of looks like they're saying that it's Justin Bieber saying this. Like, he's the tattoo artist. <laughs> People with siblings will have a, an advantage in this Witch Slice is Bigger quiz. I feel like this slice is just further away. Oh, what? <laughs> they look the same. Which choice is bigger, A? Eh? I thought it was gonna be a trick question, honestly. E. What? I feel like this is just basic stuff. They are not the same. That looks wider. Mmm, you're wrong. B. B. That's the same. Are you, are you, are you serious? I feel like that's the same. You scored better than 45% of other takers. I've got great eyes. 
had a sibling. Had? Are you saying my sibling is dead now? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I need funnier quizzes. These aren't funny enough. Give me funny ones. These actors are the same age, but you can only choose one while losing the other forever. What? <laughs> That's such a long title. I just... <laughs> I don't know this guy. I don't know who... <laughs> who are these... I don't know who these people are. <laughs> Wait, am I saying the one that I want to lose? Oh no. No, I don't want to- I don't pick her. I pick Meryl- I want Meryl Streep- oh, Bro. I'm done with- <laughs> We know which member of Peppa Madrigal's family you are based on the unique bedroom you create. Choose between some glee ships and I'll reveal what is, the, what is the, the amount of encants at once. There's some actual Star Wars names and some fake ones. Oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be awkward. Grogu, nuts. <laughs> I haven't watched Mandalorian. I'm not gonna lie. Grief Karga. No. What? Torbo Flan. <laughs> Star Wars, yeah. Grim Worm, no. <laughs> bro, bro, bro. I'm gonna say not Star Wars. Oh, okay. Bombo Thorin, not Star Wars. Font. Bro. <laughs> Chip Tuck. He scored better than 3%. You were easily fooled by me. Please hire me. John Favreau. I can make up silly names too. I'm gonna rebrand to one of these names if any of them are fun. Gamfin. <laughs> Bombo. Yo, Bombo's kind of a. <laughs> Bombo's kind of like a. A funny, a funny Twitch name. Yo, it's Bombo. <laughs> okay. Eat at a wedding buffet and we'll guess the name of your soulmate. This <laughs> Disney wedding quiz will reveal the day of the week you'll get engaged. Hello? Oh, I'll choose between iconic Disney siblings. Oh, um... Uh, Peppa. Why is she the least picked? Um... Uh... Uh, Dolores. Elsa. Bro. Anna fucking is annoying. <laughs> Honestly, I haven't watched the Aristocrats in ages. This one looks kind of goofy. Which of these sisters do you like better? <laughs> Lila was kind of rude. I will <laughs> Which fairy? Bro, I don't know. Um... This one. I don't know. I don't know. I don't remember what half of these characters acted like. I haven't seen these movies in so long. Which of Donald Duck's nephews is your favorite? Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Oh, that's... Well, their names were supposed to be Turbo... I don't know if... And something. Turbo. That's the one that was supposed to be named Turbo, I think. I don't know. Cody or Zach? Oh, Zach. For sure. For sure. <laughs> Which twin sister? 
Maddie was low-key a pick me. Definitely live. <laughs> Which Evans have Sure pay. Which Russo wizard? Alex, of course. How do I what are the results? <laughs> are there no results? Does it just show you what people picked? Oh, okay. Can I get a funny quiz? These aren't funny. I'm not putting up Taylor Swift songs for that. To see if they can guess my generation. I like Twix. <laughs> Why does it say Milky Way and then have tons of candies that aren't Milky Ways? I'm out of these. Probably Twix. Childhood TV show. I watched Dora. I watched, honestly, the only ones out of these that I like watched was Dora. I guess Transformers, maybe. Dora, to pick a toy you just to play with. Monster High Dolls. Yeah. Pop it, bitch. <laughs> oh no. I I didn't have, I, I, I wanted Cabbage Patch, Cabbage Patch Dolls, but I didn't have any but Monster High Dolls. And Etch-A-Sketch. I had the two. Pick a band. I don't know. None of, like, I'm not, am I supposed to pick the band that was around during my, like, when I was a kid? Because, like, One Direction was popular when I was a kid. Actually, mm, kind of. I'd say out of these, I probably like Beatles the most. I don't know. Fast food place, McDonald's. <laughs> Color palette. Um. Uh, this isn't funny. This isn't a funny quiz. This is just a quiz that's guessing my generation. I want to see if they say I'm a millennial, and then I'd cry. I kind of like this one. Um, call me, baby. Hey, I just met you, and this is crazy. <gasps> Hit me, baby, one more time. Oh my god, wait, these are all, like, good. Call me maybe, for sure, for sure. Gen Z. Olivia Rodrigo is your queen, no doubts about it. What do you mean? Is Olivia Rodrigo all of Gen Z? Only young millennials can pass this quiz. <laughs> it's Sharpay Evans. I don't know who this is. I want to take this. Xenon. What the fuck is Xenon? Oh, um... Let's push pop. Wait, what the fuck? What are they? Baby bottle pops. I think. Yeah. I can't... <laughs> this is a millennial quiz. Listen, listen. I don't know this. This is... That's what dreams are made of, right? Yeah, Lizzie McGuire. Oh, um... Uh... Uh... Bro, I don't know. Britney Spears? <laughs> Which was not a popular trend in the early 2000s. Um... Right, like, oh, true, that was the 80s. The Cheetah Girls sing a song named after which Disney princess? Cinderella. The name of this candy. I don't know. 
Atomic Fireball. A oh, wonder. I was gonna put that in there. Who has Demi Lovato dated? Justin Bieber. Demi Lovato, not Vito. Why did I say Vito? Lovato. I feel like she's dated Justin Bieber. I don't know. I don't care about celebrities. I have arrived. Wonderball. I didn't have that. I don't know any of this stuff. <laughs> what Disney Channel movie? Halloween Town. They got like the Halloween Town. <laughs> this is a millennial quiz. This is a. Listen to High School Musical Gems. High School Musical is Gen Z too. This quiz is calling me a millennial. Hold on. Plan a birthday with a with a, why not a million? Why is it why is it nine hundred ninety nine thousand? <laughs> quiz packs. Here are the fifteen best quizzes. Should I take the BTS one? I know nothing about BTS. <laughs> um, best quit. <laughs> oh. Any type of dis. Oh, this is just like. That's just like voting. Boomer exhilarate. No, that's. Uh, I feel like that's like. A lot of that stuff was like older than me <laughs> on that quiz. Boomers and mil millennials and boomers are totally split on these design trends. Yeah. We're gonna find out if I'm a boomer or a millennial. Plot twist I'm neither. Do you like shiplap as much? No thanks. Would you prefer a traditional wood pen wood panel? No. <laughs> no. That's just like sad feeling. Yes, I'm a fan. Would you build build a home office shed? Yeah. Is your home office more library chic? Um, what does that mean? It depends. I don't know. Do you love folding staircases? No. <laughs> they look ugly. Do you like the look and function of a classic one? I feel like they're gonna say I'm old. But also, this that's because it's this is between millennial and boomer, and I'm neither, so... I don't like this either. I don't have strong feelings. Are these contemporary house numbers the new classic? Um, no. It depends. Is the TV mounted over the fireplace trend? Height of luxury. What if the TV falls over into the fireplace? I feel like that would be kind of silly. I'm a fan. Is this still? I'm a fan. Are you a fan of big fan? Wait. <laughs> Are you a fan of big fan? Are you a big fan of floor to ceiling windows? No. Or would bay windows be your pick? This is like the windows that they had in Girl Meets World. <laughs> um, it depends. I don't know. Yeah, actually no. But not this this I would I would line up Comey to World is peak Disney Channel. Honestly, I okay. Bro, I had like a hyperfixation on Boy Meets World for a long time and I watched that whole show. It's like seven seasons, I don't know. 
I watched the whole thing. It was way better than Girl Meets World. Not gonna lie. But Girl Meets World, still good. Girl Meets World was still pretty good. It kind of held up. But also, they like... They ruined, they ruined some of the Boy Meets World characters. They made, they made Sean and Angela break up. And I was like, what the fuck is that? What is wrong with that? That was, that was stupid. To showcase your book collection, would you go for this? No. Yeah. Would you opt for a modern futon? But it was like the only thing on Disney. I did like, yeah, I did like it when I was like, when it was like on. It was, it's, it's like a fun, fun show. Yeah. But I wish that Sean and Angela didn't break up. So I did like when he like, um, married Maya's mom. And also, I, I think Angela the actor for her didn't want to go on or something because the people were being racist to her during the original Boy Meets World or something like that. I didn't really read up on it, but I'm pretty sure she didn't go on for good reason. <laughs> but I wish they would have been like, oh yeah, Angela can't come. She's out of town right now, you know, because I, I loved Sean and Angela. Of course, racism got to ruin everything. Yeah. To let your guests sleep comfortably, would you opt for a modern futon? It depends. Honestly, all of this depends on the rest... The rest of the room. Oh, this is kind of... I like this one. Just all these smart lights in your home. I I'm a... I'm a fan. I don't know. I'm a fan. Let's say you're building a house. Hypothetically... Hypothetically, you're building a house. Let's say... <laughs> oh, no, no, McMansion? No. I would be upset. Yeah. I would be so... I think living in a mansion would be depressing. Unless you have, like, tons of people in it. But I feel like otherwise it would be so depressing. Like, having that much space, you know? Do you like the... Es 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 let ex eclectic nature of a gallery wall. No, especially because of that word. What the, what the fuck is that word? Eclectic, eclectic nature. I love the eclectic nature of this wall. This wall has such an eclectic. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right. And for art. Or for art, are you a one and done kind of person? I think art like this on walls in general is cheesy, so no. Elegant concrete floors. I don't want fucking concrete. I would like, no. No, ew. I hate full carpet floors. Can you get behind flexibility of an open concept? Let me a little bit of an open concept. I'm gonna break down every wall of your house for a little bit of an open concept. No. Just a poke up. To find purposeful space. Yes! No! I have one of these. There's one of these in my house right now and I hate it. There's- it's so annoying. I'll go into the room. I'll go into- we have like a little like gym room thing and I'll go into it and the door will slam so loud behind me because of the stupid weird door. No thanks. Doors to be actual hinges. Yes, of course. And also it doesn't close properly. It's like weird. Keep yourself warm and cozy. Would you buy a user-friendly electric fireplace? I don't want an electric fireplace. That's boring. Yeah. But I don't really need that because our fall fruit robes that was super trendy no i feel like the people end up like spilling stuff on them and i feel like they get gross and then they get like crunchy i feel like these always get like crunchy and gross i don't like them ew no <laughs> a rain shower heads the greatest thing since sliced bread no then it gets all in your eyes 
All right, traditional, yeah. Um, it depends. Um, I like, I like, um, sure. No, we have one of these two. <laughs> we have one of these two and it's fucking ugly. Oh, I like chandeliers, but also I wouldn't want them in my house because I wouldn't want my house to be fancy. I want my house to be like cozy. Will granite co countertops stay on trend forever? No. Laminate. No. I just don't care about countertops. No. Classic wooden bed frame. Yeah. Um. Open. Sh Why is this quiz so long? I just want to know if I'm a millennial or a boomer. <laughs> Open shelving in the kitchen. No. The actual cabinet system. I'm a fan. You planted every. Yeah. I mean, I would have plants every corner, and some of them would be fake, so yeah. Would you line your kitchen walls with modern subway tiles? Um, depends? I don't fucking... Eclectic? Why do they keep using this word? What does eclectic mean? What's eclectic? I don't... No, that's ugly. Metal roof, snow. Sure. As long as it's not metal. Imagine when it's raining. It rains so much here. That's gonna be so loud. Are you obsessed with the stainless steel appliances? Uh, no. Classic. What appliances? Eh, classic. Classic appliances. Is it done? Is it done? Are they gonna say if I'm a boomer or a millennial? Are they just not gonna say? Hello? They didn't even give me the answers. I wanna know if I'm a boomer. It's not even gonna tell me. It's not even gonna tell me if I'm a boomer or millennial. Hello, panda to person. Welcome to the stream. Hello. It didn't even tell me if I was a boomer or millennial. I'm not, plot twist, I'm not either of them, but I wanted them to tell me. <laughs> divorce? I'm gonna answer divorce for everything. They kiss a stranger. They blew a bunch of your joint savings. Divorce. They decided they want children, but you don't. I'm just gonna say divorce on everything. Wait, what was the... You've discovered that they're the child of notorious serial killers. Emotional affair with a colleague. What? They confess that they had the worst. They had an affair that resulted in having a child with some someone else. The worst. They voted. I'm just playing divorce for everything. <laughs> Does this have answers? I don't think this has answers, actually. I don't think this has answers. I want a quiz that has answers. Why? I don't, these aren't quizzes. These are just like... Oh. I want to know my red and green flags. Okay. What flavor of potato chips? I kind of like the classic. I kind of like the... I th I go with I go with a bit of the classic ways. Um. Pick a color you can never ever see again. Um. Um. Go like this. This like. Hmm. Go with like this random shade. Oh, that's like a whole row. Oh, this isn't one color. This is like whole rows of colors. What do you mean? Mm, I'll go with like, oh wait, there's tons of like yellows down here. Okay, like bluish greens. No, yellowy greens. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. 
but because there's a whole other row of greens that counts here like most of them most of the colors are in one row but that one's not happy birthday your friends party any cake how big of a slice do you want um that big if you could have any of these pets which would you pick um the cat oh wait I forgot. maybe a bunny <gasps> snake i want a snake kind of actually i kind of want a snake no i want a cat i literally have these glasses <laughs> where are they they're literally oh i don't know why i just pressed i literally have these glasses right here i can't show them they're literally exactly the same glasses these round ones i don't know why i just pressed i might have like leaked my like email there a banana that one um do you pick? I like her hair. Which dish do you go for first? Um, I'm a vegetarian and I think all of these have meat. Can I get the... Oh, yes. Fortune cookies. Of course. Wait, can I just get the... Can I just get the... <laughs> I can just have the soy sauce. <laughs> Oh, or I can eat the chopsticks. The chopsticks are my favorite dish to go to first. I'm gonna eat the chopsticks, of course. Walks you to one of these tables that has have the booth part, of course. Why would you why would you sit on the other part? Who sits on the who gets a half booth, half chair table and sits on the chairs? Psychopaths. Psychopaths sit on the chairs. Psycho. What's the first thing you notice about Zendaya's face? Her eyes. She got pretty eyes. How do you write an A? <laughs> like, <laughs> literally worse than this. Like, what's the worst quality in right here? Probably like. If you could only eat one of these fruits for the rest of the nurture's daughters again, which would you pick? I don't really like any of these. Probably a banana. Type 5. My red flag is that I genuinely don't think I have any red flags. No, I definitely have red flag. <laughs> My green flag, you like to bring your loved ones random gifts just because you saw something that reminded you of them. Not really. Okay. Give me a funny quiz. Give me a funny quiz. Oh my god, I want to know the secret truth about me. Pick a color that makes you feel the happiest. Um, I think yellow is like a happy color. Like yellow or no, yellow. Do you feel the saddest that color? Actually, I'm kind of this purple color is kind of sad. Let me stop skipping. I'm trying to see the colors. I want to go back. Because that's a color that I, like, wear a lot. I don't really wear- I, like, I feel like purple is kind of like- I like dark blue. What color makes you feel the most calm? Like, probably that green color. No, because if I was in, like, a room full- of, If I was in a room full of, like, w like, fully white, I would be so stressed out. I'd be so stressed. I would say, I really like this color. Makes you feel a little uneasy. This color. Makes you feel exhausted. Honestly, the yellow kind of. Like I feel like the, like the yellow or the red, I feel like the others are kind of like, easier to look at you know so i feel like it's more difficult to makes you feel the most energetic um actually no brain 
feel all warm and cozy this one most confident that one pick the color that is your favorite none of <laughs> I don't, that one probably um pick the color you hate the most um one of these two I'm too bright that one Pick the color that best represents you. Well, like, okay, my character's, like, vibe is, like, like, I got, like, the red background and stuff. Like, my my little, like, my little, like, persona guy is associated with red, so I'd say red. You're very social and have lots of friends. Mmm, yes. But you're scared to let people really get to know you. You have a lot of casual friends that- okay. Okay, yeah, I do have a lot of acquaintances, but I don't, I don't, I don't know about like friends per se. <laughs> okay, I can guess your age and zodiac sign based on your fried food preferences. Pick an appetizer, mozzarella sticks. Pick some fries, waffle fries. Pick another potato dish because why not? Um, okay, um, pick an entree. I don't know. I'm again a vegetarian. <laughs> I don't know. Pick a side. Um, onion rings. Pick a fried favorite. None of these. None of these. I'm a vegetarian. I'm just gonna like pick a random one. Let's do corn dog. Choose something sweet. Um. Oh, beignets. Twelve through twenty-one years old and a fire sign. Okay. Well, I'm between the ages of 12 and 20. I feel like that's like... I feel like that's like a regular age range for people taking these quizzes. I feel like that's like the age range they give everyone. Or is that an age range or is it saying I'm 12 or 21? What food are you having for breakfast? Any eggs? I don't know. I can guess your zodiac sign, is that what it said? Based on the Fuji. See, I have, I have, I have, oh, maybe toast actually more. Um, what drink will you have with your breakfast? Water. Definitely not milk. What will you have for a mid-morning snack? Oh, popcorn, not gonna lie. What's for lunch? What's for lunch? Um... I, okay, I have like, I'm vegetarian, but I'd have like a veggie burger. Like, I like veggie burgers, they're nice. That's probably the thing I most likely have out of those. What will you have for dinner? Um, ooh, sushi or spaghetti? I like the, I like the avocado roll. I'll go spaghetti. What do you have for dessert? Um... Um, cheesecake. I love cheesecake. I'm a Libra. I'm not a Libra. None of these are funny. Okay. Bro, this chair is like squeaky as shit. Um. Hmm. Dumb BuzzFeed quizzes. Is Katie upset? What did you do to Kate? Katie. Wait, is this quiz popped up? Oh, I'll take this one. This image is lo no longer available. Why? Why are they? Why are they no longer available? Why are none of them available? 
How long does this go on for? <laughs> what? What is this? These are the only options. <laughs> Chris Hemsworth, Katy Perry, Hannah Montana, Beyonce, Vanilla Ice, Ron Weasley. Those are the only options on it. Why did you ruin everything? Or did you- did you ruin everything? Oh, did you- why did I read why? Why are the images available? Why is Katy upset? What did you do to Katy? I pushed her into the snow and asked if she liked it. I threw a big basket of oranges at her long, beautiful hair. I asked her about her day with the attention of falling asleep. I learned her kind but foolish to a swamp and cut off his beard. That one. What happened to the kitchen? It's a mess. I baked a cake using the heat of my body. I held a party in the kitchen but only invited large dogs. I started making pancakes, then fell asleep for two days. I forgot to, how to make ice cubes, then one thing led to another. Pancakes. My car's ruined, what did you do? I drove it into a very hard lake. I tried to turn it into the car from the flubber, but it was nearly impossible. I feared its power and hurt, and hurt it before it could hurt me, just like in Ender's Game, the novel by Orson Cook. Scott card. I was eating delicious. I drove it into a very hard lake. The cat looks terrible. What did you do to Mr. Whisker Briskers? Got him a book from an indie publisher. I tried to make him fuse into a duck so that he could be at least half duck. I hate his fur because he Ugh. it was shiny like keys, which I also eat. I taught him that every sunrise means a sunset. I ate his fur. The town! The town is on fire! What happened? I fought the law, and the law didn't win <laughs> that one. Wait, I want to read the other ones. I punished the wicked and released their sins in the air. I'm not 100% sure this is my fault, to be honest. <laughs> I kind of like I tripped. No, I like that I fought the law, and the law didn't win. Ah, oh, the American political system! What did you do? <laughs> okay, you know this isn't... I successfully ran for president on a grassroots campaign. I did a really bad job once. I tried transitioning us to technocracy, but no one was willing. I dressed up as Jim's. I don't know. That one. Great job. You ruined everything. Yay. I ruined everything. Yay. I'm so happy. Bro, why did one of- who- who's- this is the person that rated me yesterday. They just went live with addressing the allegations. <laughs> Bro, it's just Minecraft, I think. I should rate them back after this. Um, what else is here? My god, did you really just threaten to kill one of the Hemsworth brothers? Oh yeah, I'll do the- I'll do the- I'll do the- the, the fuck Mary kill quiz. Let's see. I'll probably say kill for everyone. Which Hemsworth would you fuck? None of them. None of them. <laughs> they never- do you think he'll be f Wait, this is kind of funny. Gemsworth, would you- would you fuck? None of them. Who would you marry? Who would you kill? I'll go with- I'll go with... Liam. I plan to kill Liam Hensworth. This is akin to a death threat. My god, did you really just threaten to kill one of the Hemsworth brothers? Admitted murderer, you might as well just enter your guilty plea now. You've never even met the Hemsworth brothers, but you can't wait to kill one of them. I also want to marry one of them. 
I also want to fuck him. <laughs> You're a maniac. You'll never get away with this. Do you think you'll be fucked, married, or killed in prison? Married? <laughs> Wrong. You'll be all three. Did you even bother to look up if any of the Hemsworth were single before deciding to marry and fuck them? <laughs> Master manipulator. You were planning to insert yourself into their lives no matter who got hurt. What were you thinking? Hemsworth I married helped me escape from jail. The Hemsworth I... Hemsworth... Not after you killed his brother. Trinity, your plan was to... <laughs> marry a stranger. Then murder sex to other strangers. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Murder a stranger marries better than... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Your admission has been forwarded to the local police. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna end stream because it's almost it's almost it's almost ten p.m. I think it's good tomorrow. I do a little bit of school. And I have homework still. What's going on on Twitter? Sonic is a fictional character, and so is your dad. Michael Afton is trending. That's not Michael Afton. This isn't Mike Lafton. Bro, Loki. Loki wanted that my hair black. But also... I would get called emo. At school. Sonic is a fictional character. So is your dad. This is gonna be my going live tweet message. I just saved that. Thank you so much for watching. Let's see if anyone's live. Let's see if who's. Let's see. If, let's see if anyone's live. Um. Is it worth it to rate on one viewer? Eh. Or in Gexy. Gex. I don't know if, if, if that's even right. They rated me yesterday. Bye boy. Bye boy. Go raid. Go. Oh boy.